what's up ladies so you guys see I am ready to do this quick hair tutorial this week is available at juicywigs.com yes juicywigs.com I've had this unit for a while now and I just got around to editing the video so I do apologize for that now this is a kinky straight lace frontal the color that I have is a number four and 22 inches it does have the combs on the sides and in the nape area as well as an adjustable strap first thing I want to tell you guys is you definitely need to go ahead and pre-pluck this hairline and definitely make sure that you wash it like you know put a little bit of conditioner in it it doesn't have to be deep conditioner but you know just put a little conditioner in it because it does make the hair super soft and it just makes a lot of you like it just makes a big difference in general so as you see right here I'm just putting some of my concealer and I'm going to try to fix that part up the roots are not dark on this unit it is all one solid color number four which is cool because I'm really feeling this color like seriously it is so hard to find like a kinky straight wig that has like this particular color of course this is Brazilian hair this is 100% Brazilian human hair so keep that in mind like these are like really nice units there are a bunch of different colors on their website the one that I originally picked was the color 4 slash 30 but it would have taken a little bit longer so I went with this number 4 which is still so pretty um, this unit reminds me a lot of one that I made but that color that I made was a little bit kind of like on a sandy side and I love love these colors that especially in kinky straight hair I think kinky straight hair is like so pretty is very like universal I think it blends really well you can either curl it or wear it straight me personally I love to wear all of my kinky straight units kinky straight or just straight I really don't curl them too much because I just like them straight um, it just gives me like that totally different look so when I wash these I definitely just leave them on a mannequin head and let them air dry it just tames them it lays them flat it makes them straighter and it also makes the hair softer now I am using my Gorilla Snot Gel just to apply the lace just to lay it down a little bit along with my baby hairs and this was like a really easy task like I'm telling you guys I really do like this unit and like I said they have loads of different colors so make sure you check them out I've never heard of this website but you know what for the most part this wig is banging so yes you guys I hope you enjoyed this video okay you guys so real quick because I really wasn't gonna even say anything I was just gonna do the video silent and just keep it as it's like a really quick fast-paced tutorial and just do voiceovers which some of it was done voiceovers but I really do like the color so much that I was like you know what let me say at least a couple of things I love this color like the color is so pretty it's a color number four and like seriously it reminds me so much of the unit that I made which was a color number 10 it's a little bit lighter than this same hair attack your same color I mean same length but just a little bit lighter than this and I really did love that wig so much and I still do have it the only problem with it is it seemed like once I flat ironed it the texture just kind of like changed it doesn't get as full and it tangles now this is the lace front as you guys seen and I've never heard of this company but they reached out to me and I was like alright I'm gonna try this I'm gonna choose something totally out the norm and it was this particular color this color I'm like in love with it it's a number four like I said you can get like a mixed blend if you want of course it's gonna take a little bit longer but honey chow trust and believe they got so many different colors for you to choose from when it comes to yakky hair texture that or kinky hair kinky straight hair that listen I have never seen any websites offer so many color variations or bar variations of kinky straight hair especially for a wig so definitely if you want a wig like this definitely check them out um, the longest length I think was like a 22 or 24 this is a 22 inches now I did have to pre pluck the hairline because it wasn't it was a little bit thick and you know you want it as natural as possible so I did pre pluck it especially because it doesn't have dark roots so I went in and took my topic hair filler fibers which is in a dark brown and I just like sprayed some of this on so the best way for me to actually spray it on and let it keep is if I spray some hairspray And there you have it. It'll give me like the illusion of some dark roots, especially with some hairspray. And there I have it. But I'm not too concerned about the dark roots. Normally that's what I like, but I really do like this hair. It's soft. Um, honestly, when I received it, it didn't smell that great. It had like this, I don't know, like this really 
like a god awful smell. I think it was because they sent it to me kind of damp and put it in plastic and it had that, that kind of like wet smell. But also I noticed that it wasn't as soft as I knew it could be so I decided I'm going to just go ahead after I finish pre-plucking the hairline and conditioning. And it came out a whole lot better. So just keep that in mind. If you do decide to order from them, the hair is not going to be as soft as it would be if you condition it. So definitely condition the unit. But other than that, this wig is bomb, baby. Of course, you got to do some stuff like some pre-plucking, but honey, it is so worth it. And they're fairly, really inexpensive. So definitely check out Juicy. I will post all the information below for you guys. Let me know what you think of this unit. And as always, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs this video because you love me and I love you guys. And I'll see y'all in a soon-to-come video.